Coming up next, it's a Bantamweight title fight between Bruce Lee and Sean O'Malley. So here's the number one Bantamweight contender making his way to the Octagon. Got to be some nerves here as he gets set to compete for the UFC Bantamweight title. No denying he deserves to be there. He's got the requisite win streak. He's got the finishes. He's got the popularity, the fan support. Now he needs the championship performance. We'll see if he has what it takes to unseat the incumbent. All right, here he is, the UFC Bantamweight Champion. He has successfully defended the title in the past. A decidedly different challenge, though, here tonight. Prevailing wisdom is that this will be his toughest title defense to date. The odds suggest that this is a close matchup on paper, but he believes he's one of the GOATs, one of the greatest of all time. If you want to be that, certainly got to make good on this title defense tonight. And now our tail of the tape for this bantamweight championship fight. More than five years apart, with some differences in height, but the same reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, a referee in charge, Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Bantamweight Championship of world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record of 16 wins, one loss, and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, presenting the challenger, Sugar Sean O'Malley. And now, Introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC bantamweight champion of the world, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! All right, this is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up and we are underway. Well, these guys have been on each other's radars for quite some time. Tonight, it shall be done. Both guys well-rounded. You think he's getting a kickboxing match? Not a you just don't know, right? You don't know who's going to be able to employ their strategy the way that they need to. This is a close fight on paper, and also in every performance we have seen them put on, these guys seem to be the mirror image of each other. Ooh. A 
uppercut lands for him. Oh, oh. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Right hook to the head blocked. Oh, nice punch there by O'Malley. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Circling towards the left now. Just misses there with the left. Lee gets hit with the kick. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landed. Just missed with the left there. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Sean O'Malley. His opponent still stands. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Way to mix it up. Huge elbow land from the clinch. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Nice kick landed there by Lee. Kick to the head. <laughs> Trying to hammer that lead leg. Liver kick. Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Serve him up. Go get him. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Strike there now. Close guard. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. All right, we'll see if he postures up and can get some of his ground strikes going here. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Oh, his opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Oh! oh, Johnny picked him up and he slammed him, and he ends up in side control. Now he's in no danger of a submission. How about that? He's like, you go here, <laughs> my arm's free, and now he's got plenty of room to operate here out of side control. Nice Nicely done. Job. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Great punch landed with so much power. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Sean O'Malley. Oh Round two is next. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes.
All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole push. Oh! Well, he's up, but oh, is he hurt. What a tricky head kick. And now he's got that tight clinch. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Just misses with the right. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. O'Malley gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. He's already landed several in this round, and the damage is really starting to take its toll. Yeah, it's really starting to take its toll, and you watch the opponent walking gingerly on his leg, and one big tell that you're starting to really do well with your leg kick is when your opponent starts to switch stances. Right. Watch for a stance switch very soon. Dig and kick. Nice defense there, huge block. Oh, just misses with the kick. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Nice straight punch. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Good jab. Right hand on point. Oh, looked like he was trying to set up the head kick, but he misses on that attempt. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. again here, but hurt him. Big body kick lands. Came of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. 30 seconds now to go in the round. It's very tricky when you throw that body kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. 
big liver kick lands under the elbow. O'Malley's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you got to think the knockdown is going to be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin, but he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. You ready to fight? You ready? Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also... Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by O'Malley. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Lee gets hit with that hook. He's got to be careful here. Leg kick. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Powerful leg kick lands. Oh, blocks the shot. Circling towards the left now. Oh, big head kick lands. Another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. So there he is, the undisputed UFC bantamweight champion, and what better way to get the job done tonight? Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 47 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, and new undisputed UFC bantamweight champion of the world. Sugar Sean All right, we have a new UFC bantamweight champion. This is a moment that every fighter dreams of, and he turns that dream into a reality here tonight. It is the moment that we all wait for, and when it happens, you are almost in shock that it comes to fruition. Tonight, he accomplishes his ultimate goal and becomes a 